company has registered over 10 million users in the seven months that the Nairobi Expressway has been in operation, resulting in revenue collection of 2 billion Kenya shillings during that period. Now, the PS in the Ministry of Roads, Joseph Mbogwa, hopes that the milestone will help attract more investors into the country to bankroll more public-private partnerships. Faisal Ahmed has more on this story. More than 10 million Kenyans have used the expressway over a period of seven months, according to Moja Express Company, the company that manages the expressway. <laughs> CEO Steve Zhao says that they have collected 2 billion shillings in the months of operation, registering more than 10,000 vehicles to use the electronic tolling system. So each trip, 200 shillings. So right now we have the 10 million trips. So how much? Like... Uh, Two billion. Two billion. While attending the ceremony, Rhodes PS Joseph Mbugwa stated that the achievement of the expressway will attract more investors into the country to venture into more private-public partnerships. So where we stand, we look forward for even more Kenyans to use it because it will give us an indication of how others can also implement similar projects. The PS further stated that they are still in consultative meetings with PSV operators on modalities that will allow them use the expressway. This after a series of accidents involving public service vehicles shortly after the road was launched last year. The issue is discipline. If only we can have a model where they will take responsibility of whatever their matatos and their vehicles do, then we can now have some assurance of having them back. But until that is settled, then we we'll want to say that we we'll desire that we have more engagement with them. The tolling stations at the expressway have now put a provision for M-Pesa payments for MTC users moving away from the mandatory cash-only system. The company is also in discussions with the government over the construction of an exit toll station that would lead directly into the central business district along Haile Selassie Avenue. Please receive this as a token of our appreciation. Faisal Ahmed, Citizen TV. Nairobi. Sassini PL.